it going boys? Hopman Spider here. First uh, recorded PvP game. Uh, we're on Radar Hill. Uh, we got Americans versus the uh, Germans. I uh, went with the irregular doctrine. Seems to be uh, the best way to get infantry out is the Americans. Trying to do a heavy push at the start for uh, the middle. Uh, just a couple riflemen going off to the right hand point. Some pretty good action on this map. Um, the other player was pretty good. They spread out well. Just trying to cover my left flank here so I can see if he pushes me. A couple riflemen. Getting up to the middle here. It's always good to get a couple troops into that bunker, it seems like. Alright, we got our first shots ringing up here. First shots off. Looks like we both brought a squad to the middle. Got rifle grenade there. Took out a couple couple guys. Good good shot. Another rifle grenade. Pretty handy. MG forty two is just ripping us up there. Bring some of the lads up from the, the right point. Push up onto the main. <clears throat> Keep pretty good pretty good control of the middle most of the game. I think it's kind of one of those things, whoever gets control of it first. MG42 is just ripping us apart. Pick up that rifle grenade. It's pretty handy. It's reinforcing. Trying to use that rifle grenade here to take out that MG42. There we got an SMG infantry in the bunker. Uh, just try to use lots of infantry on this and overwhelm them. It's kind of hard playing as the Americans sometimes, but find if you just keep bringing out single riflemen. Keep pumping up riflemen and uh, um, automatic rifleman teams. You can kind of get your numbers up pretty quick. Got my first captain out. Three minutes and forty. See here, got an AT anti-tank team up to the center, just anticipating uh, an armored car push on us. Got one boy sneaking up for a grenade it looks like. Here we're just trying to keep our uh, right flank secure so I push up a couple guys. See if he's pushing us. Looks like we're going to get rid of that M242 finally. It's been tearing us up. Got MG42s on our flank here on the on his uh, on his left hand side. He's pushing my my right. Just trying to keep good control of my infantry. Keep the center locked down. Just making sure my bar gunner has ammunition. 
I don't know if it's worth microing these kind of things, but a oh, little bit of lag. Not sure where this where this guy was from. Seemed seemed to be a little bit of a laggy match at points, but ran flawless at other points. I'm gonna try and sneak another grenade on his squad. Got reinforcements coming up. See, I'm bringing lots of single riflemen up. Pushing up on the right. Figured we might try and flank his MG. Good to micro your grenades. Get lots of kills that way. This guy just absolutely gets overrun. Try to save him a bit here, but I don't think there's any saving him. Those are elite mountain troops. I think we try to get a cheeky grenade off. He's got a push coming in. Those are elite troops. Ah, uh, he moves just before I can get a grenade. Might get lucky here. Yeah, yeah, pretty good. Little grenade there. Killed three of them. <laughs> now we got a grenade war going in the middle here. Those troops are strong. They can take grenades. A grenade landed right in the middle of them and they survived. Throw another one. Still, one guy survived low health. Now he starts to push me out of the middle here. I brought up my ammo crate because I American infantry seemed to run through ammo pretty quickly. I've had that happen a couple times where have a squad holding the point down, and then you look, and you just see the ammo, uh, ammo warning. We're both throwing grenades at each other. Lots of deaths in the middle there. We got some reinforcements coming up. 29th Infantry. Got our second officer, seven minutes. We got our first special unit from our doctrine. First special forces or commandos. Should have bunch. Should have uh, spread out a little bit more with these guys. He's got his reinforcements coming in. Oh, what a slaughter! MP40 just destroyed my guys there. He's got MG42s all around the point, just shredding me. That MG42 that basically just shredded my whole squad. Got him. MGs are so strong for the Germans. It's the equalizer. You know, the Americans got their M1 Grand. The Germans got the MG42. And this is what I'm talking about. See, we're at ammo here. Separate my rocket launcher and my signaler. <clears throat> got a mortar coming up. He's got a lot of infantry, so I figured let's get a mortar. I think he threw smoke on me. Just reinforce in the middle. Grenades going. focused you know each player kind of has their own point and then you fight for the middle it's kind of a kind of like the way this map is with the 
play it a little bit more. So yeah, I'm starting to push up to flank that MG that's been mowing me down. Kind of stuck in the trenches. Got MG fire always mowing down any push that I try and make. He's got a couple guys coming up. Here we're going for our flank on that MG. It's been kind of keeping us pinned. Excellent flank on him. Oh, he's got a sniper somewhere. Don't know if I ever did find it. We got first mortar shots going off. Knocked out that MG. I didn't want to keep those guys there because they got sniped. I think he's panicking a little bit now, that mortar. Keep those guys laid down. Trying to get grenades off on his guys in the trench. Push up a little bit. Now I think this armored car was supposed to take care of my uh, mortar. Now I pulled my sniper back, I didn't want to get caught, caught open in the open. We got our uh, special forces. Oh, looks like I just used my regular anti-tank infantry. Probably should have used the special force guy, he probably would have been more accurate. But This cow almost gets obliterated I think, but we save him. Crude the mortar, so I had to put a guy back on it. Here we use our mortar signaler just to push him out. Wasn't too sure if he had guys there or not, but figured push him off a little bit. Push my sniper up. Push up with another squad to my right. Try to flank his point. Mortar's just chewing him up. Signaler is not the strongest, but you can do a little bit of area denial. He's pushing up some infantry. I think I'm trying to sneak a guy in the trench so I can grenade him. Centimeter auto cannon. Quite a scary unit. But let's see what our rocket launcher can do to This is the scary part about fine vehicles. You have such good range on these rocket launchers, you can just annihilate vehicles. Especially on these maps where the terrain sloped. Looks like he got a mortar counter counter batteried my uh, my mortar. So I just want to put a little bit of pressure on him. Figure pull up an M3 half track. Let the 50 cal sit and do a little bit of a little bit of work. Mortar's just doing damage to me now. Uh, and there goes my mortar. Got this lone soldier holding off the squad. <laughs> so I figure let's see. keep fire superiority and throw a grenade on him. 
squads pushing up. We got the half track pushing up. 50 cal just lighting them up. Now he threw a grenade, but I kind of microed our guys out of the way. Now I'm going to start pushing towards this point. This mortar seems to be doing some good damage, trying to take out my half track. Squad moving up, trying to take his uh, his right point and be my left. Cows running around everywhere. I'm sorry, cows, and he quit. So I think he's seen the writing on the wall. But uh, GG's. Um, got another video soon. Keep playing some PvP. Maybe get a conquest going if anyone wants to see something like that. Surely shook with pride. He checked on his equipment and made sure his pack was tied. He had to sit and listen to those awful engines roar. You ain't gonna jump.